Welcome to AudibleEars.com. This video will document the installation process of a plug-in hybrid electric vehicle. We're going to install a battery box into this Prius. We're going to remove the plastic on the right and the left, the seats, and the battery box, as shown here, will mount on top of the spare tire. Removing the back seat gives us access to these bolts. These two metal brackets are removed. The next thing we're going to do is to remove the high voltage safety plug. This makes the battery somewhat safe to work on. That is the current sensor. We will be running a wire through it and through here into the new battery box. The current sensor has to have the hole enlarged for the new wire to fit. Okay, we're test fitting the plug-in supply battery box. There are two studs where this remote sensor was mounted. Here. And on the right rear, with a threaded bolt goes and there also. This is the plug-in supply box as it arrives with the outlet for the rear bumper and the interim control board installed. I have printed off the interim control board safety modification that we will perform. The 20 lead acid batteries uh, please ignore the Prius tail lights on the pallet, but that is 20 lead acid batteries drop shipped here by plug-in supply. We've marked the holes and Tim here is going to drill them all the way through. This is can view in the glove box with that ribbon cable winding up in the trunk in the battery box. This is the other end of the ribbon cable, the front end being in can view. It winds up at the interim control board right there. This is the battery installation. There are 20 lead acid batteries. These are by BB Battery. Notice the connection from there to here runs behind the battery in this open area. Also notice that each and every battery connection has a, a washer and a lock washer critical that the lock washers are present. Arcing can occur if these connections should become loose. We don't want to have a plasma event. I have to adjust this rail forward because this row of batteries won't seat firmly. We've already installed the gas struts and I've already removed two of the four knurled nuts so here goes the next to the last one. Voila! My intention to adjust these nuts to make room for the battery. That's all.